When Michael Jordan's daughter Jasmine was a young girl, the greatest basketball player of all time in her eyes was just an ordinary human. MJ was a present father to his children, and despite all his fame, he never really demanded his kids to understand and appreciate his greatness on the basketball court. That's why Jasmine and her younger sibling never thought their dad was a global phenomenon growing up. It was only later on that she fully comprehended the fuss about her father. Jasmine, who was born on December 7, 1992, was only 5 years old when Michael won his last championship with the Chicago Bulls and was 10 years old when he played his final NBA game. So it makes sense why the fourth child had a lot of catching up to do and all it took was one simple Google search. When I was a child and growing up during the time, I didn't really understand what was happening because I was so young and it just didn't really resonate with me until I got older. Jasmine said, as reported by AP News in 2020. I laugh because I actually googled my dad at one point just to figure it out. I was like, why is everyone so intrigued by you? You're just dad, you're not that cool. But lo and behold, he was kind of a big deal. So it's definitely been something that's been eye-opening. When asked how MJ treated his daughter, she said he was actually present in her life. She admits that she's a daddy's girl, so Michael would always protect and nurture her. Jasmine mentioned that MJ did his best to be involved in her life, even during his playing years, specifically for school, dance practices and recitals. On top of that, her dad was as competitive with his children as he frequently tried to motivate them to ace their exams in school. I mean, he'll do that to me just so I can get an A out of a test or two, Jasmine said when asked how competitive MJ was in the household. Just like many people who watched The Last Dance, Jasmine learned a lot of new things about her father. The documentary helped her understand her father's basketball legacy more and made her realize why he was such a global icon. But unlike most people, she could easily talk to her dad about the documentary and see his reaction firsthand. I'm harassing him. Jasmine said she was frequently texting her father while learning more about him in the docu-series. Speaking of The Last Dance, we just recently learned how much money Michael Jordan made from it. MJ earned a paycheck of $4 million, but zero went into the Chicago Bulls Legends bank account. He received zero because he donated all of it to charity. MJ is no stranger to helping charities and organizations. He even pledged to donate $100 million to help eradicate racism in the US. With a $2.1 billion estimated net worth as of 2022, it's clear Jordan didn't lose sleep donating all his earnings from The Last Dance. So why did he agree to do it? Mike is a savvy businessman with a motive for his every move. He wants to push a personal agenda to remind everyone that he is still the GOAT of basketball. As the GOAT debate became blurred in recent years with fans putting Kobe Bryant and LeBron James at the top with Jordan, the last dance reminded everyone that Mike is still the best to do it. Jasmine is also one of those reminded. Now she is 30. It's safe to assume that she's finally fully grasped who her father is and why he will always be remembered by the world.